everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm going to show you how I usually do my everyday makeup, um, which kind of sort of looks something like this. Um, it's This is like not very heavy, it's actually very very light makeup, so I don't know like how much is showing, but there is something on my face. Um, Let's get started! Okay, so the first thing I like to do is usually I would use a face mist and then I'll use a very light cream or lotion, gel cream. So I'm not a professional. I don't actually really know how to do makeup. It's just usually how I would do my makeup. And then I will use a sunscreen. So my face is not actually that dry today, so I'm actually gonna skip the dry skin primer. What am I do Oh, okay. <clears throat> and then I like to use a setting spray and just layer that on before I put anything else on. I'm gonna be using foundation today. So this one is the NARS Light Reflecting Foundation and I have the color in, I think it's L2. So shake it because it's serum based, I think. This, I like to also give it a couple of sprays. And then usually one pump is enough for me. Um, and then I also like to mix it with um, setting spray. So like two, three spritz, mix it together. And then I apply it like this. I like to do really light layers, but with the um, mixing it with that, you kind of have to go quick because it does dry. I have an eye bag. I don't know what to do. I think I might try to use this one today. So I don't actually know what I'm doing. Okay. And then the lighter color. I think it looks better. Does it look any better? And then what do I do? I don't remember what I usually do. Um, I think I usually, I think I usually seal it down again. I also know I use way too much, but I can still see my eye bag. Okay. And then I use dry powder. This one's purple. Okay. Time to do the eyebrows. Eh, looks good. I have a highlighter, makeup forever. So what I usually do with a highlighter is I kind of like do the under eyes. And then I have, I don't know if like you guys have this problem or like if some of you have this problem where it's like, you know how like your nose, it's like in the middle of your nose. So I do have like this little bone that kind of sticks out a little bit in the middle. And this part over here, is basically just like a little darker. What I usually do is I use the corner of this, take a little bit of the highlight powder, and I like to just kind of put it over that a little bit. And then lightly just over here, which kind of covers the eye bag just a little more. And I forgot the brow mascara. And then I like to do my eyeshadow first. And oops. And I use this 3CE palette. Um, and me, this is the um, Dear Nude palette. Just kind of all over the place. Somewhat a little more pink but not too pink. Did it do anything at all? Um, a little bit. My two eyelids are actually also different. This one kind of folds more inwards than this one. So they also just look different. And then what I like to do is actually, in replacement of eyeliner, I like to usually take this Let's see, take this one, the sharp skinny edge one. And then I have this other palette, this one's Novo. And I like to use the darkest brown that they have here. Um, 
Actually, no, not this one because this one's sparkly. I don't use I don't usually like sparkly, so I use um wash silk color. I use a different setting spray. This is actually leftover setting spray from the last um this is my new one. This one's um this one's Prammy. And I spray it on this. It's not that noticeable, but it's there. Um, yep. I don't know, I like to do my eyes kind of light like that. I don't know why. And the next thing I do after that is I take this brush and I like to use this. This is Pistachio Blossom Color BBIA. Oops, this is like a shadow thing. So I do this. I kind of just go like this and brush it out. Do a bit of a shadow by the nose. Then I also use the same thing for my, this area. I also don't actually know how to apply it. I go by the feeling. And then I like to use a very like pastel light color um, blush. Have it over here. I think I'm gonna go with mono pink today. This is 3CE by the top of the cheekbones. And then just kind of have that a little over this area by the eyes. Put some on my nose. I think I usually use another layer of setting spray. Okay, that's enough. So I'm gonna go again. Okay, so the camera turned off. Um, but we're gonna finish off with a, um... I think I applied too much. I applied way too much. The heaviest part of my makeup usually is on my lips. If I do want it like a little darker though, the only th other thing that I would do is really just clip my lashes and use mascara. And it's weird, I, don't, I just don't know how to apply like eye makeup. So lighter actually looks better on me right now. Um, so yeah, this is what I usually do for my makeup on days that I need to do my makeup. So that is the end of today's video. I hope you enjoyed watching me do my makeup. Um, if you would like me to make a video of just recommendations of what types of skincare and or makeup products are good for dry skin, um, leave a comment down below. I have a lot more that I've tested and I find that they also kind of just work really well with dry skin. Anyways, if you enjoyed, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to check out my other channel that I have with my sister, The Matcha Vlogs. I will have the link in the description down below. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!